there's something in each and every single one of us. People are born with something that continues to grow inside them. Something that wakes them up, something that drives them, something that tells them they have something else to live for. For some of us, this ambition, this determination, this goal-driven behavior disappears. Our intention no longer gets to our execution and something is missing in between. You see it everywhere we go. To cancer, to some rare disease, to a, a fatal breakup. This thing that we allow to break us. We have to understand it's possible to conquer it. I had a great friend, Graham Gentles, young kid. He decided to take his own life. I still read it today. Hi. Hi, my name is Graham Gentles. And I'm doing my speech on Joe Bridges. Joe is one of my really good friends. And he works at the YMCA. I've known him since I was 10 years old. I don't remember the first time I met him, but it feels like I have known him my whole life. He's like the brother I've never had. He's been a mentor, basketball coach, and all-around friend. By mentor, I mean someone I can look up to. Actually, he is 6'2", reached that height at the age of 17. The American Heritage Dictionary definition of a mentor is a wise is a wise and trusted counselor or teacher. It comes from the Greek meaning advisor or wise man. Joe always says work hard and your dreams will come true. as who I am to have the courage to see success in every situation and not a failure he believes in being there for other people that service is important which is why he works at the YMCA gives meaning to his life. He believes that most importantly, recognize that you can do almost anything if you set your heart and your mind to it. Graham wrote that when he was a senior in high school. <laughs> 